What's up everybody, my name is Erver and welcome back bros to one of the craziest videos on my channel. Okay, so in today's video guys, I'm going to be revealing my brand new Skyblock Island and a lot of you guys have been waiting patiently. It's been probably almost a week of just building and grinding for this island guys and we have spent so much hours building it and I hope you guys enjoy. Okay everybody, so once again, I have to pretty much give a shout out to my whole island guys. If we do IS2 right now. Just shout out to everybody that's on my island, especially Dalmore, Living Spring, and pretty much just everybody on the island for helping out, guys, grinding in the last couple days. And also, shout out to Snowbulk. They're not on my island, but they were also helping me, which was pretty cool. Anyways, guys, it's now time to show you guys the island. So this is actually it over here for all of you guys that didn't already see it. A bit from my last video, which was a bit of a time lapse. If anybody's wondering, the island, like the whole thing, like the grass and everything, Thing is done but like the structures like the buildings that we're going to be building are not really completed but once those are completed guys which is probably gonna be later in this season because I want to build like a building maybe like once every episode I'll probably do like another update island tour but right now let's go and show you guys this island Yeah, this is our island over here guys, it's super crazy, and if anybody's wondering what we're doing with these armor stands, I, I don't even know why they're here. <laughs> Pretty much, we have to go and get the heads from each of our teammates, but we're gonna have like each of our teammates like kind of up here. I'm gonna be over here pretty much everybody on the island on like one of these armor stands but yeah this island has just been so much worth the last couple days guys and i'm super happy to now show it to you guys once again it's not completely finished we're still gonna keep building this throughout the season but we pretty much built like all the grass and trees for now which is super crazy so this is it over here as you guys can see we have a lot of trees wow Next up over here, my friend actually built this. It's kind of like the year, I guess, which is pretty cool. And then this over here, guys, actually one of the things that I decided to go and build, which is actually an igloo. So hope you guys like it. If you're wondering why I use redstone torches, if we use normal torches, it, it's gonna burn down the igloo. <laughs> And yeah, it'll pretty much melt. We got a mod's head in here, which is super crazy. We also got like a bit of a portable inner chest, which is River's backpack, which is pretty crazy. So this is what's inside the igloo over here. Next up, a lot of people are probably wondering, what is this giant tree over here? We're going to have more giant trees on the island, if anybody's wondering. But this one over here at the moment, we're currently just using it for storage area for like all of the building blocks and spawners that we still have to place in on the island, which is pretty crazy. And then I guess over here... Um, I, I don't really know what my teammates are building. But yeah, shout out to Love and Spring. I think they're putting a sign down right over here, guys. Anyways, it looks like it's actually Mario Um, on the toilet re reading a newspaper. Fun, let's go. Let's have more fun. I'm not really too sure, but shout out to Love and Spring. And it says, by Love and Spring. Hey, so shout out to them over here, guys. You are a great builder and YouTuber. But anyways, guys, this is our first Pixar on the island. Actually, our second because this... This one was actually the first one which I built. I hope you guys like it. If any of you guys come to my island and like look at this and it looks like wool or bricks, just make sure you switch to 1.12 because a lot of the blocks on my island are made with 1.12. So I wanted to make it a bit newer of an island. So I use newer blocks. They're a bit more expensive, but definitely worth it. Yeah, that's the YouTube play button over there, guys. Super crazy. Next up, I actually got my llama. Yeah, we got my llama in here, guys. I got a green carpet on him, which is super 
super crazy guys anyways that's it at the moment and then next up over here guys i wanted to kind of go and make this sort of like a beach area you walk in here and if anybody's wondering what this thing over here is you're pretty much supposed to stand under it like press the button guys and it's gonna go what is going on? It's supposed to be a shower, guys. Anyways, bros, it's supposed to be a shower, so we just go under it, guys, click the button, and I guess the water's supposed to come down, kind of for decoration, but I thought it was pretty cool. And this is the pool, guys. And then we got a bit of, like, an exit area right up here, and then we go to the rest of it, which is, like, a waterfall, and that's pretty much it. Uh, we got a beach area over here, which is pretty cool. Let me know down in the comments also if you guys like the beach area or that snow area that most of my friends built, so yeah. Yeah, definitely let me know down in the comments, though. And yeah, that's pretty much the whole entire island. I mean, like, there's, like, some random ponds around the island and a bunch of trees, guys. But like I said, it is done, like, the building part of it. But the aesthetic part, like, the decorations are still coming, guys. Like, we still have to make ourselves an IG farm, which I completely forgot about. If you guys are wondering how much spawners we actually got, we didn't sell any of our spawners to build this island, guys. This island over here actually was pretty cheap, but... If I show you guys in my Allen PV over here, this is it over here. We got ourselves over a stack plus of uncommon iron golems, which is pretty crazy. And yeah, so definitely, guys, Grinder will probably be up by next episode. My teammates are actually working on it somewhere on the island, like right now. So yeah, I just wanted to go and get this video out to you guys as soon as possible. And now let's talk about prices, guys. So I'm going to tell you guys exactly how much this island costed and it was actually pretty cheap guys i know it took us a lot of time for you gonna pay a builder to it it's probably gonna be about double maybe triple the price but guys this island over here actually only costed me less than five million dollars guys which is pretty insane because the budget for the island was actually 25 million and if anybody's wondering we probably would have made this island a lot bigger but we built straight to the world limit so yeah we can't really build out any farther guys yeah overall guys i had a super fun time building this and i'm actually surprised like how cheap this island was like we spent like so much money on like quartz then like a bunch of 1.12 blocks as you guys can see and it still came out very cheap but yeah i've still got 23 million probably gonna go and spend the rest of that on iron golems or something later in this video but to go and start it off guys i want to go over to open a bit of crate keys okay everybody so we've been opening two crate keys for like the last couple days like two glacial crate keys two frozen crate keys and today i thought we'd go and open up two crystal crate keys which is actually this crate key right over here for all you guys that didn't know some pretty cool stuff in here and if we can win those iron golems that would be really cool anyways without further ado guys we're just gonna go and spam them today let's go guys one two and we we both got banknotes. Okay, first one over here. We got ourselves a credit note. No. We got ourselves 115 MC most. So we have to do slash redeem. Okay, bros. I guess I'm just going to go and put on like acrobatics or something. And we also got ourselves like 30k over here. Anyways, that was today's crate key opening. Hope you guys are enjoying the videos so far. Once again, I'm saying this a lot. But if anybody actually ever wins the cough and gets a cough crate, I will trade a glacial crate key or like 5 mil for one of those. So if anybody has one of them, I'll pay a lot of money. Just message me. But yeah, I really need a cough crate key, guys. Anyways, next up in the video, I think I'm actually gonna head back to Malin because, like I said, I wanted to go and buy some iron golems and maybe some creepers. So let's do that right now. So if you guys didn't know, if you do slash shop, I think most of you guys probably already know. But instead of going under the mob spawners, since I actually have like a rank on the server, you can actually go in the donator shop if you have a rank, which is super crazy, and you can. Can get like discounted price like a creeper in here 1 million or so and then if we go in here like the normal price it's 1.5 million so if you guys get a rank on the server it's definitely worth it because you can get exclusive deals guys also there's like a 75% off sale right now make sure you guys check it out link down below but anyways I'm actually going to go ahead I don't know guys either I'm going to go and buy some iron golems or I'm gonna buy some creepers. I'm really tempted for the iron golems though. You know what guys? We have ourselves like 60 iron golems right now. And I think we need more. So I'm gonna go ahead 
and spend a lot of this. I think I'm gonna buy 10 iron golems and I'm gonna leave a bit of money in case we do need to go and spend some more money. Okay, there we go, guys. I just bought 10 iron golems and I'm just keeping around 10 million because I still wanna be on battle top and also, you never know, I might need some more money for the island, guys. But anyways, there we go. We now got ourselves 10 more iron golems. And also, I think once we actually make the iron golem grind, or as you guys can see, my other iron golems are actually uncommon so i'm probably gonna go and spend some of the rest of my money also on upgrading them which is actually only 250k per one so that's actually pretty cheap if you ask me so i'm probably gonna do that anyways for now i'm just gonna like keep it in there with the rest of my iron golems guys but there we go i hope you guys enjoyed today's video guys i just want to give you guys a bit of a tour of my brand new island so to go and wrap up the episode over here i think i'm actually going to be making a welcome sign okay guys so i'm gonna do the welcome sign right now guys let's do welcome right over there and then like bracket so there we go guys we now got a welcome sign s warp river in one two three but anyways bros i think that's going to go and wrap up today's video so if you guys haven't already make sure you go down below and slap that like button and also subscribe to go and see daily minecraft videos and i'll see you bros in my next video peace